from thinking that going crazy would get them out of a messy situation. What am I doing? Do not You to feeling like they were untouchable after causing an accident. Don't touch me. I will report you. We're not doing this. Do not touch me. Please do not touch me. I will report you. Here are several examples of when entitled drama queens meet no-nonsense cops. Starting with the case of Nicole Golomsky, who tried to order the cops around when she was pulled over for driving with a suspended license. Don't raise your voice at me, dude. I have daddy issues and I don't like men. I don't trust them. Listen. I have PTSD. Do not talk to me like that. Do not. On the 1st of January 2023, Wisconsin police officers on patrol duty pulled over a vehicle upon noticing that its driver had a suspended license. When they approached the vehicle, things quickly took a turn for the worse when the female driver decided to turn an otherwise simple traffic stop into something else entirely. Phone, waiting for me to leave my gas pump. Look around, dude. Well, the reason you really why don't I'm have anything over. better to do on New Year's Eve, New Year's night, New Year's Day, when there's all these mother get that out my eyes. It's not even I right. didn't do anything illegal. Pointing, pointing I right do here. know I know your is gonna pull me over. I okay. saw you're sitting at you know why? parties, parties, yes, because you know you're why? lazy and you don't want to pull over somebody with actually where you have to do paperwork. Who has a suspended driver's license? Oh. I got a suspended driver's license, but you could pull somebody over drinking and driving, right? Okay, can I have your ID? No. I don't have it with me. My name is Nicole Glomsky. You know who the f I am. Okay. Because you just said I have a suspended license. Do what you got to do with well, your dog. Well, I have to verify dog. who you are. I'm don't not find anything. anything. I don't give a f And your buddy back there can bring his dog. You guys do this to me anytime. I've never you met suck. you before, okay, so I don't know awesome. what you're talking about. Why did you creep at Quick Trip so until I left? Answer that. Because I saw you at a suspended driver's license. How did you see that if you're on the other side of the parking lot and then drove around my vehicle, then drove around again? Okay, you know what? I don't need to answer you. you. don't have to answer. I don't have to answer. What's you. your name, sir? He doesn't have to answer you, does he? With the way she was handling the situation, it was obvious that she had previous issues with the police. But her current actions were not helping matters at all. And she would soon give the cops a very good reason to arrest her. Why? Get it out of his eyes. You're not wearing a seatbelt. And neither the... Am I? Am I? Neither am I. I don't know that. Oh well. Quit talking to me. What's your name? Boss. He does not need to tell you his name legally. You're not gonna try to make somebody. He's a passenger. Did I do anything? You are wrong? being this is entrapment. Do you know that? You're gonna it's get not in trouble. Entrapment. Yes it is. If you think I'm gonna get in trouble, it's my charge is right here. It, what is that called? Harassment. Have you been drinking tonight? No. Breathalyze this. Breathalyze this. Get it. Get it. How do and I I'm know? Your eyes are glossy. glossy. Yeah, I smoke a lot of weed. You been smoking tonight? Nope. When's the last time you smoked? None of your business. You smell weed? Nope. Are you going to find weed? Nope. Sorry, you, you wasted your time. I don't actually. I think I do smell weed. You do? Search it. I told you, f***er. Get your dog. I don't need a dog. Do you got weed on you that you would put in my car? Why would I have weed you, on you? You seem like a dirty, lazy cop. Oh, that's So when you dig through my car that. and you're... That don't find nothing... Don't be upset and then have to give me a ticket for suspended license and drive away like a piece of cop. Why don't you? He wasn't wearing a seatbelt and didn't want to ID himself either. Dude, this guy waited at Quick Trip for me. For no reason, I'm pumping gas and doing my makeup. Ready to actually go to a friend's house okay, and have you? a couple drinks. How much have you had to drink already? Not breathalyze me. I'm not talking to you no more. All right, I'll be right back. Although she felt like she was in control of the situation, she would soon come to realize that she was dealing with some no-nonsense officers who wouldn't mind teaching her some good lessons on civil obedience. Let me ask you something, sir. Do you have a valid driver's license? No. No? So neither of you are leaving here then until I we don't. have a valid driver you know also. what? I can walk away, can I? You can't leave right now. If I'm not being detained, yes, I can. No, you are detained. How? You're getting a citation. That's you're not, not going detained. anywhere. That's not being detained. Yeah, you're not leaving. So are you willing to tell me who you are, what your name is, sir? No, he doesn't have to. I'm telling him not to talk to you. Do not. I'm not talking to you okay, right well, now. I don't want him stop talking, talking to you. Stop talking. No. You need to stop talking. Me Step out of the for vehicle. no reason. Step out. Come here. I'm going to talk to you back here. No. Do I have to listen to him? Yes, you do. Walk to the front of that car, please. I just want to know, dude, speaking person to person, like, why, a, yeah, I would why love are to you speak. guys not, there's one, two, three, four, five cops here. Look at how why you're reacting. 
because I'm not trying I'm to mistreat you. To I'm not time. like trying to make you feel no, bad. No, listen to me. Please let me finish. Sure. There's so many drunk kids, meds, alcoholics, people with so much stuff that if you pulled them over, you would actually, I don't know, it would feel like you were doing good because they were drinking and driving or they had drugs or they were doing something bad. Okay. But why pull well, you physically told me you're smoking pot or weed all the time. Because you're being a thing. My eyes are glassy. You smell weed. Actually, I do smell weed now. You know you don't. Eventually, she began to realize that she had messed up. But unfortunately, it was almost impossible to get out of the mess she had put herself in. You don't smell weed. You don't smell alcohol. I haven't been drinking. Okay, for That's one thing, lying. it would be lying if I was lying. I'm not lying to you. Don't raise your voice at me, dude. I have daddy issues, and I don't like men. I don't trust them. Listen. I have PTSD. Do not talk to me like that. Do not. I'm not lying. Everything I say that we're talking about is recorded. You know recorded. how scary this is when you see like this happen on the news. Where None of this get, would even have gone this far down. or be to where it is people right now. Held down by if you guys you have, choked like, out. If you could at least have the slightest bit of and respect. I am a Brad. I do not. I want to walk away from you because I don't owe you shit. Listen, but you know what you would do? Walk to the front of my car. You know what you would do? Just walk to the front of that car. You would physically hurt me. You would hold I'm me I'm not out. going to. You, but if I tried to I'm not to even going to touch you. You would. You would shoot my Just have a seat right there. Relax. Yes, go ahead. I have to give you permission, not him. No, you know, I don't need permission. Because yeah, the more I talk to him, have my head in the car, I can definitely smell marijuana. How do you know what marijuana smells like? Give that marijuana. You, do you have your phone with you? No. Irvin, do you want to try to call somebody? Because you guys aren't driving out of here. I'm gonna hand you your phone so you can work on a ride. I don't need a ride, I'm gonna push my car. Okay, well, I'm gonna go knock on that door. I'm gonna verify that's your uncle and he says it's okay, you can sure. put your car there. Sure, yeah. Why do you have a hatchet in your door? Yeah. I can have whatever the f I want in my door. I can have a gun in my door. Okay, thanks. That's all I wanted to hear. Shot you, right? Nope. I thought you didn't have an ID. Yourself. That sounds like obstructing. Uh, you say, I, I, I hear all kinds door. of things. I know I I just don't want to talk to you because I don't want you to keep yelling at me. In the end, she was charged with operating a vehicle while suspended, failure to wear a seatbelt, and failure to have a passenger wear a seatbelt. Agreed that Nicole might have been an entitled woman who had an attitude to go with it, police officers have had to deal with even crazier drama queens, like Nancy, who went psycho when she realized that she was going to jail for making life very miserable for her neighbors. You're hitting my head against the wall. No, I'm not. Yes, you are! You just did! On the 9th of July, 2023, Officers were called to a scene of a domestic dispute between a woman and her neighbor over their property lines. When they arrived at the scene, they had no idea that they were about to deal with one of the most entitled neighbors ever. Me? Yeah, you. I live here. Cool. Can you go inside for me? My home is being intruded upon. Okay, I'll be with you in a moment. I just want to separate you guys so there's no further disturbance. From who? You. You're screaming me as I'm walking wife. up. Me and who? You are screaming as I walked up here. My home is being intruded upon and you're telling me to go inside. I'm, I'm asking you May to go I inside. May I request a different officer, please? Sure, you can talk to Officer Valpone here if you don't okay. like the way I'm treating you. Since there were two sides to the dispute, officers thought it wise to talk to her neighbors. It was at that moment they began to understand the nature of the person they were dealing with. I think I was here last time. You were. Yeah. Absolutely. What's going on? So you built this metal thing, right? No, I mean, the, 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 the whole fence, thing. The fence. Okay. She complained because the, 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 the fence is supposed to be on her property. Okay. I it's supposed I'm, to be on her property? Supposed to be. She say like that. But I don't know. This is why I made my own. She says it's like too far over on her side. Their dogs pee like shit. All they do is just pour water on it, and it always yeah. goes onto our side. Sure. So my dad put like something here to block it. Like a like this gutter thing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So are you guys? This is my wife. Anyway, okay. I think, yeah. So I'm trying to figure out what's going on. That's all. So a lot of this started off with these people being very rude to my wife. I told them, "Hey, get your property off of my property." Oh, so you put the concrete thing here to block yeah. it. Yeah. And then and she blo broke it. Broke the water. Yeah, and she broke it today. They built a fence back up onto my property and destroyed it. So I was contacting the city okay. to get it taken care of. Okay. Um, and then this curb is on my property. She's rolled her ankle multiple times. So I said, "You know, it's on my property. We're taking it off my property." Yeah. And don't, don't, please do not look at the line because they drew the line. Right, with so, me. Like, the so line is based on the property. 
At this point, her crazy attitude was already beginning to get on the nerves of the officers, but since they were after a peaceful resolution of the dispute, they decided to ignore her. At least for now. Here's the thing. Property line disputes, not a police yeah. matter. I know. We're so not, I that's do not this, why you that's also here. not a police matter. Well, if you just, well, here's the thing, is if you destroy it and it turns out it's their property, then... Well, until right, then, it's not your matter okay, either, then. you shaking your head and have an attitude towards me? I'm trying to figure out what's going on, and you go like this, and da, 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 talking to me in that way. Right, I think right, you're, you're jumping ahead. I am a very you. respectful person. Well, then speak in a respectful tone. I am. No, you weren't earlier, and I'm trying to say that. We're trying to keep this civil, because right? Because the second I got out, I was told to go back and Okay, and yes for someone different and now I'm talking to you and you're throwing attitude my way when I'm speaking with your husband And he's explained this you chime in with some snotty remark as we're trying to figure out what's going on, correct? I'm not trying to be snotty. Well, you're acting that way and you're speaking in a snotty well, manner Well, if you've lived here long enough to have to put it put up with this, I'm not trying to be snotty but I'm do, not. Do, do you think when we're trying to figure out what's going on no. that making snark comments and speaking in a manner like that helps I, the I'm situation? I'm not trying to. Also at the she's same really time She's really upset because they told her to go back to when China. You came up and I mean, told so me to she's go a little back heated inside. at this moment because, because of this type of stuff, right? When we hold up, Which, we'll park all the way I mean, there. I mean, she's not I trying to be rude to you guys, but so the heating up of like telling her to go back to China. A that's a really messed decision. up thing to say. And someone, someone ends up being arrested. So your decision is based on my behavior? Oh my god. No. I'm not trying to do that. They're saying she's screaming racist remarks in our neighborhood. No. So, but that was so I understand. That was after they told they say go back. Okay, right. But two wrongs do not make a right. But we're saying that's why this officer asked you to go inside to calm the situation and we'd be in to speak with you. But you chose not to, right? Forgive me for that my property's been intruded on for as long as it has. The fact is, like I said, I have to live with this every day and I am frankly sick of it and for them to tell me to go back to China, I'm not even from China. But like I said, this is the line they drew. This is a curb they laid. And this, well, you know, as you can problems, clearly right? see, crossing yeah, I mean, yeah, the structure yeah, of the home yeah, of mine. Okay, I get that, but then why are we destroying this today? Because, like I said, if you come Very over big. here, this line was not laid by the HOA. Okay, who was this it laid line, by? Them, that ain't gonna be here. Okay, but then you can be, that is, if it is their property that they built and you destroy it, right? The oh my God. Hold on a second, the property line thing is it, we don't know. So now you're destroying someone else's property. Nope, it's yeah, on my property. You're being unreasonable at this point? I am point. not. Yes, you I are. am not. Can I finish talking? Yes, sir. Okay. As things unfolded, it started becoming obvious to the cops that she didn't have any justification to be causing a disturbance. Now that the situation started looking like the cops were not going to be on her side, it was only a matter of time before she unleashed the craziness that she had been struggling to keep inside of her. They poured concrete there because you guys were urinating and defecating in your yard. No, nope. that, that is not the case. Okay. They that put is it, not anyways, the case. They put that there, correct? That's what you told me. They put that cement barrier there, correct? What they did, yes. Did. So then that is the cement part is not your property, correct? Correct. You so someone has the right to something. put it on my property. Is it your property though? Do you know for sure? Do you have yes, a legal document? Yes, I do. do I am more than... Do you have a legal document that says that it's your property? My deed will more than definitely tell you this is the line. Here's the thing. Don't... You, you've taken a day. You emailed a day ago, right? These things take time. Just because you decide your whatever goes on and you're going to destroy this, that's not how adults behave, is it? Neither does a husband, right? Okay, hold on. Hold on. We're talking about an inch or two. Inch or two. No, it's like more than six. If I go onto your property being your next door neighbor and I go do the exact same well, thing. I'm polite how well with my neighbors. I so am until I'm not. That doesn't make sense to me. Well, what law did I break? So what, that's, that's malicious, malicious mischief. mischief. Malicious. How about they maliciously built something on Which my you have no legal documents property. to. That's what you're missing. What is there legal document to build anything okay. on my property? Legally, so, physically, as you can see, attached to my property. There's two ways to resolve this issue today. Ma'am, ma'am, hey. you look at me. There's two ways to resolve this issue today. You calm down, or we may have to take you to jail. Why, what did I do? You committed the crime you of malicious crime mischief. mischief. There's and two you ways. You that. You won't, won't you? Say that again in front of them. They know this because they, you destroyed their property. How about they maliciously laid it onto how my is, property? How long has that been there? How long has that Does thing... it matter? Yes, because I have you... been asking and asking and asking, and they refuse to remove it. Since she kept yelling and acting all crazy with the cops, they began suspecting that she might have had a bit too much to drink, which might explain her crazy behavior. 
They decided to give her a chance to avoid getting herself into trouble, but whether or not she was going to take that chance was another ball game entirely. How much have you had to drink today? Too. Too much? No. Too much. Because you've had too much to drink today. You're baby. Why is it always me and my drinking? Well, let's see. You're the one destroying stuff. I didn't destroy it. I am it. removing something that is on my property, and it does never, it does not always equate to me, my drinking. I'm going to tell you how it's going to go right now. You are going to go inside. You are not going to cause a disturbance the rest of the night. I'm what disturbance to, have I caused? Um, screaming racist remarks. Oh, and they haven't? I'm not saying they haven't. I'm saying that. Why am I going inside and they're sitting out here? Because they're not the ones screaming at the police in the parking lot. Oh, because they just didn't do it while I'm not here? They have not done it since I'm here, correct. Two neighbors came outside and said that you were screaming racist Hispanic and Mexican related remarks. I did not, remarks. and I told them to come here and look, and then they went okay. back inside. We're not going to get into specifics. No, and that's Here's what what's I'm gonna saying. Here's what's going to happen. You're you going to go inside or you're going to jail. Than what you think it is. So yep. unless if you have it on video, because I didn't say what you think you Go think inside or you're going to jail. This is your last chance. Do you understand? I didn't do I know. anything. I know you then go inside. inside. Okay. Uh, my property is being intruded on and I'm getting ordered to go inside? Just right now, just right now, please go inside. You guys, can I be taken to jail for yelling at them saying, Gail? You guys, move your f***ing fence! Move your Go inside your house. How about you guys do something about this? Why am I getting ordered to go inside? My property is being intruded on. No, you're not. You never have. You never have. You never have. If I go to jail, it's your fault. It's your f***ing fault. She steps out. Move your she needs to go inside. Nancy, they, you need to go inside. Why? This is my Yes, I can hear you screaming. You're causing it's a disturbance. It's my property. No, it's my property. Why are you removing me from my property? I'm not removing you. I'm putting you deeper inside your property. While she was complicating things for everyone, she had no idea that she had now given the cops more than enough reasons to take her to jail. Nancy, if you don't go inside the police. It's your fault. It's your Okay, it's my fault. Please go inside. Please go inside. Let me go! It's your sister. Just please. No, let me in. No, Eva, Eva, Get me Eva. in. I'm going. Come here. You're under arrest. Why? No, no, no. You're under I'm arrest. Put your hands inside? behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Because I'm going inside. Stop. Oh. Move, sir. You're under arrest. For what? Because I'm already going guard, inside. Guard, guard. That's your fault. How is that my fault? You ain't doing shit about what you're supposed to do. What am I doing? What am I doing? Do not kick me. I didn't do not kick, kick me. You stepped on me. You stepped on me. Yes, go ahead, toss me. Go ahead, toss me on the ground. Go ahead, toss me. Let's go. Toss me on the ground. Yeah, with my. Fence while oh, you're at you it. No, you did that. I clearly see your f***ing hand. Yeah. You yes. I hope you're happy. Doing nothing. Doing f***ing nothing. Okay. Well, okay. She needs to behave a little better. I'm behaving. F*** you. I'm a f***ing adult. Act like one. You f***ing act like one. Well, I'm here. You ain't doing shit about people encroaching on my property. That's not you my concern. You arrest me. No, of course it's not. Nothing is your concern until it is. That absolutely How, is what the f do you guys do? How, what do you do? How I was going inside and you still f***ing arrest me? You did not go inside. You began wrestling with your sister. Does she complain about it? It doesn't matter. That's and illegal. You? Oh, is it? It is. There now you, you two f***ing seriously think about it. My uh, property is being intruded on your arrest. Do you have anything sharp that's going to stick or poke me? No, I don't. Okay. You yes. are welcome to search. I am going to search you. Can you stop moving? Spread your feet. How much further would you like? That's perfect right there. Can you hold that for me? Thank you. Go ahead and get inside the apartment there.
Eventually, she started realising that she had been messing with the wrong police officers all along. It was at this moment that she began to realise that it might have been better to have listened to them in the first place. All right. I want to let you know that you're under arrest for malicious mischief in the third degree, and I'm still going to investigate whether we're going to arrest you for disorderly conduct, okay? Yep. My home is, like I said, being intruded on. Okay. And this is what you get. Is this your quota? Uh, no. We to don't arrest somebody just because? Nancy, I'm going to be honest. I would have preferred to just leave and resolve the problem. I wish you, you would have, and I was going inside. I was trying to have a smoke. I was seriously just trying to have a smoke and you came in into my little corner of where I was going to smoke and you that arrested is, me. That is 100% correct. Yeah. So I was going to do what you wanted. Do me a favor and just stop talking. So and not talk. Yeah, of course. That's yep. what all you guys ever want. <laughs> Fucking stop talking. Fucking stop talking. That's all you guys ever want. Let me know when you're ready. Ready for what? To read your rights to you. <laughs> You have the right to remain silent. Let me I didn't. Safe. I wasn't aware that I had any rights. You have the right to remain silent. Anything uh, safe. My, I have rights as a what? How law. my fucking you have the property right is being intruded on, and I get arrested? And have with you while you are being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you before questioning if you wish. Can you? Can you can decide you? at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any <laughs> questions or make any statements. Do you understand those rights? Nope, I do not. Which part did you not understand, or would you like to I do not the whole why, thing? I do not know why I'm arrested for protecting my home. I thought this was a stand your ground state. Before we talk any further, I need to understand that you understand your rights. I do not. Okay. I do not, and I would I would like to ask you to please ask my husband to call into work for me. Okay. To I can do that. Can you let me read your rights again so you understand them? I don't understand it because I don't feel like I violated anything other than maybe well, destroying the fucking curb that wasn't supposed to be there. And that's exactly what you're under arrest for. Well, you know what? That's great. You guys want to arrest people whose homes being intruded on? Kudos! Okay. It's really important that I make sure you understand I your rights. Don't. I don't! I don't understand. I have lost brain cells. I don't I tried. I really did. I really wanted to go inside. What's done is done. Let's focus on the future. No, 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 no. I, I know that. I'm, I'm not talking. To you. Why? Because I don't need to hear anything you have to say. Most people would have calmed down by this point when they arrived at a police station, but Nancy was not one of those people. What she had done before now was merely scratching the surface compared to what she was going to do at the police station. You need to stop punching yourself and... Okay? Yes, I... Can't. I can't. Well, yeah, you can put me in cuffs, you can probably put me in a hospital, but I can't! I can't. You can put her in cuffs, Hawkinson. So. Yeah. Right, just put your hands behind your back. We're gonna put you in cuffs so you don't hurt yourself. <laughs> you would, huh? Put me in cuffs again. Um, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> oh, I'm resisting again too. You're not resisting. I am not. I never was. Please. I don't have a choice. Please. Put your leg back. I cannot go to school. They won't give me care. Put your leg back. Please take me to a fucking hospital. At a point, she even went as far as banging her head against the glass while being transferred to another facility due to her behavior. But that wasn't a problem for the cops, who are used to dealing with people like her. Let me see if you have any injuries. Do you have any pain anywhere? Yeah, you're giving me a pain in my ass. Get it off my eyes, will you please? No. Why? Bang me. Stop. 
I can't breathe. breathe. Get off of me. I can't breathe. Get the f off of me. We have medics coming. No, you don't. Please work. I begged you. I begged you. I said, please, get off of me. Think about how well this would go. Think about it. It would go I, a lot better uh, if you listened to what we were trying to tell you. I, with the program. Hey, Nancy, I'm yeah. Officer Baker. I haven't been here before. I'm just trying to figure out That's what's going great. on. Okay? That's great. Give me my uh, I help you out. I need my Put me in the hospital right now. I can't get it off my eyes. I can try to do that, yeah. Okay? It's all over my face. Okay? I cannot not see. It's, it's beyond... Like, less than human rights. You can't do that. I want to be able to see. Get me the f out of here! All right, Nancy, my friends with the Bellevue Fire Department are here to check you out. Make sure you're medically okay. I'm so requesting to have immediate medical attention. In the end, she was charged with malicious mischief for destroying her neighbor's property. Nancy was an absolute maniac, but even at that, she wasn't anywhere near as rude as Keaton Stein, who turned out to have an even worse attitude than the women we've seen so far. Exactly you have nothing better do. to be doing right That's now. Exactly. Why does she choose to be a cop? On the 11th of October 2022, Wisconsin police officers on patrol duty noticed a young man riding a bicycle without a front light and attempted to stop him. However, they would soon realize that the rider had other plans, and stopping his bicycle wasn't one of them. You ain't gonna win, buddy. There's more cars coming. What do you guys even want? Stop the damn thing. You're gonna have a bike light out. It's just a damn bike light, you idiot. Knock it off. You wanna get bit? I'll send them right now. Running. That's all it needs. You wanna get bit? Then stop. You have no bike light. There's an ordinance for that. Then you'll be done. You don't need anything else. All you are is looking at tickets. If I have to get out and chase you, you're going to jail automatically. Because you don't have a bike light and you ain't stopping for police. What's the point? Why, why does it have to go to this dude? Why does it? Because you won't stop. You're the one making the decision, not me. Realizing that there was no way he was going to listen to them, officers resorted to desperate measures to contain him. It was at that moment that the drama began to unfold. On the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. I'm the ground. I'm pressing the charge. All right. Chill the out. Why don't you listen to it? Why don't you guys listen? I didn't do anything, retards. I already explained it to you. Oh, I didn't have a bike late. All right. Get the whole ass bike. All right. Chill the Stop resisting that. Please stop! Mm -hmm. This is fing bullshit, dude. You power hungry cops always trying to f with somebody. Guess what? If you would have just pulled over, it wouldn't have gone. Guess this what? Way, if right? you just fed off and let me go home, it wouldn't be none of us would have this problem. Okay. Are you injured? Yes! Okay, what hurts? My fing shoulder, what do you think? Okay, well we got an ambulance coming. Good. Right, roll your butt. I hope you all plan on paying for it too. Roll your side. Sit up on your butt. Okay. None of your f***ing business, dude. All right. Talk to the EMTs. I don't want to talk to you. All right. What's your name? None of your damn business. All right. Well, you can just go to jail. Not For what? For resisting. No. How do you figure? How do you figure? Because you didn't stop. I got out of my. I don't car, need to stop. stop. Yes, I wasn't f***ing doing anything. The only thing I was going to do is stop you and write you a warning for not having a. Bike a warning light. for not having a. Bike. Really? That's, that's exactly what I was going to do. You have nothing better to be doing right now. That's exactly what I was going to do. You have nothing better to be doing. Nope, this is the best as it gets. Dude, what's your name? Do you have an ID on you? In your pocket? We're gonna have to search you anyways. Is it in there? I don't answer questions. Alright. Alright, get up. Easy on the f***ing shoulder. Criminal information. Riding my bike home and I get you guys tackling my f***ing bag. I'm alive too when he ain't finding nothing that you obviously seem to think you're finding. No, nope, he's gonna search you before you go to jail, is all. Go to jail for what? Resisting, possibly wow. causing injury now. Oh, so causing injury? Yeah. yeah. I know my uh, another officer needs medical attention. Oh, too, he so. needs medical attention for yeah. what? Do you know. have asthma? I haven't talked to him. Oh, I'm sure you don't want. Because if you guys ain't in. Just sit down, please. I'm not going anywhere, obviously. Yeah. God, you guys are fucking just Why are you lame. running? 
Because I want to go f***ing home. I don't want to f*** with you guys. You guys are always trying to catch somebody up on some bull dude. I know how this works. Your name's Keaton. What's it say on the ID? Sorry. Why does he choose to be a cop? Rather than behave himself to avoid complicating things further for himself, he somehow found it reasonable to push the officer's patience with him. I feel like you're like doing uh, like good for the greater good or some. Like what? I don't know. Why do what you is it? Run like? from the police? Do you feel like you're because doing I don't good? trust the police. Look at all the people getting shot by police for walking. Oh yeah, just for walking. Yeah, just for walking. Do you have a job? Why does it matter? I was gonna ask so you if you like your job. I do like my job when I have one, but no, I'm out of work right now. Oh. Just had a job on the line, but no, I'm going to jail for resisting. So, the f ever. look at this. We got one, two, three, four, five, six squad cars for one guy. Damn. Why didn't you stop? Because I don't need to. I was biking. Well, when an officer has their lights and sirens behind you for multiple blocks. He didn't have it behind me for multiple blocks. I he just know. let me up. He initially told me to stop. I said, no, I'm going home. Goodbye. Yep, and then I followed you. And what the you f*** you guys want? Why is there six people here in an investigator? Because Undercover or whatever. Because, because you took off running. And where's my phone, too? Don't f*** my sh All right, did we form a conclusion yet? Are we good to go? No, you're going to jail, like I, I don't said. don't care. Can, I, can we go then? No, because you said you wanted medical What am I being arrested for? I'm resisting. Yes, I do. Okay, then we're waiting to get me On my shoulder, my neck, my back, my side. Y'all better hope I don't need no more physical therapy or mm-hmm. Best believe the city be paying for that. Did you have shoulder issues beforehand? Yes, I did. Okay. Y'all lucky you didn't just break my when oh, I can't stand you. All the f***ing careers in the world and y'all choose to be the one job that f***s up everybody else's day. Oh, bat battery? Are you for real? That's hilarious. That's hilarious. Y'all bogus as Oh, I'm causing injury? Why don't you look at my face, my neck, my shoulder, my hip? Yeah, boy, your officer, what, maybe got a little scratch? Aw. Have fun in jail. Why'd you run? Do you have a warrant? No, I just don't with cops. I'm sorry. I don't, it could have uh, been so much more simple. Yeah, it could have been. But, like, what was the it's problem? A, it's, it's a, a, it's a bike verbal light. warning. So let me know. We stop people all I was the time biking, that. you know? I'm all on my way home. I'm literally, I'm not up to no I was at the bar. I pushed a couple buttons. And then I went to bike home. And dude's trying to tell me to stop. For what? Ain't no reason to. It's just like a normal traffic stop if you were driving without your lights on. Same justification on if you're biking without a light on. Eventually, he began to realize how it wasn't such a smart idea to have run from the cops in the first place. I'm sorry for like, no, whatever. You really go, can't transport, really? No, I mean, he's making the arrest. All right, good one, bud. Another one for the notch. And I'm sure my bike's gonna be gone now too. Huh? Yeah, we're gonna take it for safekeeping or something for now. It's not a felony charge, right? It is a felony charge. Are you? F Fucking serious, dude? Nope. Wow. Wow. What the f ever, man? You re you realize how badly that f me, right? Well, I'm not the one that chose to run from the place. Yeah, you, whoever the f dude. Oh, f***ing hey, man. I swear to God, if this charge doesn't get dropped, dude, I'm like that's it. Like my life is basically over. Great. For some, f***ing, <laughs> you don't want your bike. Congratulations, now you're. You didn't step, or anything when you didn't step. Are you the one that said that about if you were my dad, you'd be disappointed too? What's that? Are you the one that said that about my dad? I just said I'd be disappointed if I was your parent. Well, yeah. that's not. I didn't ask for your opinion as far as that's concerned. It's pretty f***ed up. Okay, well, I. You should I... be very careful what you say to people. You don't okay. know their situation or their story. You're right, I don't. I apologize. Thanks. Uh, it really f***ed up my right side too. What's that? It feels like my kidney's f***ing leaking or something. Okay, well, we're going to the hospital, so they'll check you out down there and make sure everything's yeah, good. Yeah, let's go hope. Man. I guess. Too late for dinner, too. What's that? Too late for dinner, too, huh? Uh, I'm not sure what time they stop serving dinner down at the jail, yeah, to be honest with you. Late. Well, contrary to popular belief, we don't just shoot people for no reason. Well, contrary to facts, you do. Maybe not y'all specifically, <clears throat> but it's happening a hell of a lot lately. Who knows where the next trigger happy cop is. In the end, he was charged with resisting an officer, causing injury, and disorderly conduct. Next, we go to the case of Kara, who went savage when she realized that she could not bully her way out of drug-related charges. Back up! Back up! You're under arrest, Kara. You're under arrest. What for? What for? What are you under arrest for? What am I under arrest for? You're under arrest for you. Get your arrest. 
his hands off me. On the 4th of August, 2022, officers on patrol duty noticed a woman walking on the road in La Crosse, Wisconsin. Upon closer examination, they discovered that she had pending charges of being a party to a drug-related crime. When they approached her, they had no idea that they had just met the crazy queen of entitled women herself. I think an officer had a question with you about maybe like a theft or something. I'm not entirely sure, but can you hang tight the front of my car for me? Uh, I can stand right here. I'm not gonna go anywhere. That's fine. Okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll wait till that initial officer comes down, and then we'll we'll figure out the whole situation. Okay? Well, what kind of theft? What are you talking about? What? What kind of theft? What are you talking? About? I don't. I, I'm not entirely sure off the top of my head. To be honest with you, Sarah. Robert, go find Dakota, please. Situation about like what? Like I don't understand. I. Well, I wish I knew, but I'm not, I don't, I'm not the investigating officer entirely. Okay, so what do you know? Just that Tony had talked to you about, about a case. That they need to talk to me or they have talked to me? That, because no that, one's talked to me about anything That yet. someone needs to talk to you. That's my understanding of it. Okay. Is there any way I can give them my phone number and contact me that way? Not right it's now, I don't think. It's excessive, don't you think? Me standing here? No, it's not. No, just, I don't know. I don't like No, that's in a boat. Who are you looking for? Dakota, my boyfriend. Oh. There he is. Baby! Come here! Come here! Although things appeared calm at first, things started taking a different direction when her boyfriend arrived at the scene and started acting like he was in a position to make demands. A decision that would later turn out to be regrettable. What? I don't know. I haven't even been... I don't know. I haven't done anything. The theft of some penny case, I'm not entirely sure. I still have someone needs to talk to her. Or an officer needs to talk to her, so... So what, is it just going to be a ticket that gets issued then? Or I, I have no idea. So when did, when so, did this Yeah, when did, when did this, this theft supposedly happen? Because I haven't done or gone anywhere. I'm not the initial officer here, okay? And I probably misspoke on the theft, but someone needed, an officer needed to talk to you, so. That it was misspoken on a theft? Like I misspoke even... thinking it was a theft, but an officer needed to talk to you, Kara. So, so let the officer talk, talk to you, that comes out. You with me just because I'm right. asking questions about what the well, I'm going trying on. to explain it. You're not telling me though. You're telling me you think it's a theft, and now you don't know if it's a theft. Right. I, I just explained that I misspoke. How is you okay? So then she should be so free to go. Home. That's not how it works at all. Yeah. So how yeah. is it then? How, what is You're it then? If it's leave. not a theft. You're what not is free it? to leave. Is she under arrest? Then, She's not free to leave. Is she under arrest? She's not free to leave. You can't leave. Is she? No. Am I under arrest? Not yet. You're not free to leave. So then she's free to leave. She's not. If she's not being arrested, she's not being detained. She's detained. I just said she's. You just said it. You just said she's detained. I said if she's. How do we even not know what it is? Can you ask them what it pertains then? When it gets here, yeah. Why don't you just ask him over the radio? Give you me a second, Kara. Come else. on now. No, because I've been 41 to 66. What's your 20? I've been standing here with the pertains. Right. And then you tell me it's a theft, and now you're telling me you don't know if it's a theft? You don't know what the f*** is? For real. Why would you Gabby. sit there and lie? I'm telling, telling you what no, I know. you Kara. said you thought it was a theft. And then I explained I misspoke. I had the impression that it was under a theft. And now you're telling me that it's something totally different. I, ex I didn't so say it's totally different. Understand. I said I misspoke. How are you going to sit there and tell me it's one thing and then it's not? Right. Okay, since he's here, hang tight with him. I'm gonna make some phone calls, get this all figured out, okay? You should have had it figured out before you right. start harassing. No, yeah. <laughs> that's not yeah, harassing uh, yeah. at all. Yeah, it is. That's not. So she's not free to leave yet. From her behavior, it was obvious she was already getting irritated by being delayed by the officers. However, unknown to the couple, the officers intentionally delayed Kara to give them just enough time to confirm her drug related charges. What's going on? Uh, we're just, he's got to make some calls on some stuff. Yeah, and about he's what? telling me that he doesn't even know what it is about. Like, yeah. right. first he so tells me it's we a have theft, the right to be known then he tells when you're me getting that detained, you have know. the right to know what, what the f*** it's actually about, for so real. So what does it pertain? What is that? I'm, I'm about to, I'm about to get real upset here. Okay, well, and we got an email that, we, we got an email that investigators something. had some stuff they needed to talk to her about. So. Investigators had some stuff about to talk about what? About what, exactly? Because I've already told the investigators If you don't know, then why the, why the hell? I know what it is. Do you think because I know they want, every no, case listen, that happens? No, they want me to come in and they want me to start snitching on mother f***s and I've already told them no. I don't care. I don't know what it is. I already told him no. We don't know what it is. It's well, I know what it is. Yes, you do. I, I know don't. what it is. And I already told we him. 400 it. cases listen, a day. I already told that investigator he can kiss my white ass because I ain't telling well, him a mother thing. We'll go double check and if that's the case, then we'll be out of here. It's bull****. I'm sorry. No, I, you harassed me in the Jail about snitching on my family, and now you're coming out here in front of God and everybody to do it too. You can kiss my white ass. Word out of me. I don't want a word out of you. I, it's not me. Eventually, the officers confirmed her charges and now had reasons to arrest. On her own end, she continued to complicate the situation with no idea of what was coming. Okay. So, like I said five minutes ago, I misspoke. Huh? 
What is it then? You have pending charges for... Excuse me, no, no, no. Back up! Back up! You're under arrest, Kara. You're under arrest. What for? What for? What for? Why am I under arrest? You're under arrest. Get your hands off me. Party to a crime for delivering methamphetamine. Bullshit. Right after arresting Kara, her boyfriend, who had been trying to play Mr. Tough Guy, began to bully the officers. He refused to obey lawful orders to avoid interfering with the cops. However, just like his girlfriend, he would soon realize that these cops were not the type to take his excesses. Right now we have to get no, to the squad because you're no, going to jail. No, I'm Stop. not going to jail. Okay. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I will kick you in your face right now then. You stupid. Well, I hope you don't do that. But we have well, to I hope that you let me go. Otherwise, you guys are getting a lawsuit. Nope, you're going to jail. You bullsh**. Don't take him, please. I didn't do anything. Please, don't, yeah, take him, don't take him. Bullsh**. Don't take him. Bullsh**. Can you sit up? No. Once you let me go. We're not letting you go. Yes. Don't take him. Please don't take him. Okay. What's your badge number? Six six seven. All right, you're getting a lawsuit. Open up. And file, can I file a grievance right now? Yep. Please yeah. Stop. We can't do right that from the ground. Yes, I can. Now, Kara was beginning to realize that these were not the type of officers you want to mess with, and to make matters worse, she also had a very crazy boyfriend to worry about. No, I can clearly find one sitting right here. Can you please you're going, sit up. You gotta go to jail. No, I don't. Okay. Baby, no, I don't. Stop. That's what's going to happen. Hey, I'm talking with him. No, we're sitting up. Just yeah. hold up. Hey! 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 She said it's her phone. No, it's she's not. Getting charged related to the case. My Cole, get her out. Right now. What's up? You give her my phone right now. Carrie, you, you'll have your phone. You give Christopher my no. phone right now. No, help me get her up, please. That is my phone. I'm not taking my phone. No. Not taking my phone. I'm f***ing your ass up when I see you on the outs. I never forget a face. I haven't searched. No, you can off. Come back up. You can off. Come back up. You got any needles on here? I gotta search you. Hey, big thing, nut. All right. That's excessive. Stop. You stop. stop. I'm not resisting. You're excessively hurting me. You are resisting. No, you're excessively hurting me. Tobacco, you. Okay, find some more drugs. Stop. 
Dakota, stop! Dakota, stop! My car's over here. Dakota, stop! You gotta search her still. You're not putting hands on me. I want a female officer. I want a female officer! All I'm searching, Kara, all I'm searching is your pockets. You will give me a female officer, so help kicking. me God, I will snap. When it became obvious that the cops were no longer letting them have their way, they decided to get crazier. I want a female officer! You're not touching me! Don't touch me! Alan, get back, dude. Come on now. Don't touch me! Kara, can you scoot back you're a little bit? You're not touching me! I said you're not touching me! Don't touch me! The no! Yeah! Yeah! Matt, ah, come on! Go beat for you! Go beat it, because you leave me here! Yeah, go beat for you! Fuck it! You beat it! Keep on for you, Kara? Don't touch me! Okay. In the end, Kara was charged with threats to an officer, disorderly conduct, and possession of paraphernalia. Her boyfriend, on the other hand, was also charged with battery, threat to an officer, two counts of resisting arrest, and bail jumping. If you thought this couple was crazy, then you should meet this woman who tried to play the victim card after getting caught shoplifting. Get the f off of me. On the 1st of June, 2023, Police officers received a call from a store manager reporting a female customer who had exited the store without paying for the items she had taken. When the officers arrived at the scene, they did not know that they were about to deal with the most entitled shoplifters they had ever seen. You have to go back inside. You didn't pay for your groceries. I can't hear anything you're saying. There we go. That's a little better. Okay. So, uh, no, you are. Don't hit me with the door. Oh, oh, don't hit okay. me with the door. So, the manager came out. You didn't pay for your groceries. Can you please go inside and pay? Absolutely. Okay, Can so come on out. Now? Come on out. Can Let's go. Or you're going to be arrested for retail theft. Although the officers had given her a good opportunity to avoid going to jail, for some reason, she was dumb enough not to make use of the golden chance to save herself. Okay. Okay. Great. So, Come on, let's go. Can you now back up away from me? I am standing aggressive. right here. Okay, come on out. You are very aggressive. I am not aggressive. I'm asking you to do something, and you're pretending that you can't, and you can't hear me. So come on, let's go, or you're going to no, be placed. No, you were the on... one pretending that you couldn't. Hear I am me. not here to discuss. I'm asking you nicely to go in and pay for your groceries, you're yelling at me and or you're going. This is not yelling, believe me. So either step in and pay for your groceries, or you're going to be arrested. If as soon as you're away from me, that will happen. So we are not going to play this game. I'm not going to leave the door so you can slam it shut. Let's go. It's all being recorded so you can request a copy. <laughs> so I've asked you three times to go and pay for your groceries or I'm going to place you into custody. You are something. 33, I go, is there an additional unit down here by the Publix? So you don't want me to do it. Just when the cops thought she was going to be cooperative with them, she decided to make the worst move a thief could make. A decision that she would eventually regret. Yes, please. Um, about six parking slots in front of the... Oh, no, you're not. Get, the, get off of me right now. Psycho! What the f*** is wrong with you, asshole? Get the f*** off of me! Do you see this? I can't believe this. Get away from me. You are not going to drive off. Get away from me. You are not. Ma'am, I'm going to ask right you now. to step out of the car. Look at you. Look at your face. Please step out. I have not refused. Yes, please step out. You're being you asked understand? nicely. Do you look at your look at your skin color? Your whole skin color okay. has turned a Okay. Then let's nicely step out. Do you, or I'm, I'm gonna not going to go near you. Come on, let's step out. I will happily. Let's step out. I will happily. Happily step out. Yeah. 
Not anywhere near him. Come on, let's go. Look at it, man. Just take a breath. Are you serious? Ma'am. Yes, we're on the outside. Just take a breath, bro. It's okay. Step off, we please. can't go on the other side. What you just got there? Listen, wait, he doesn't stop. Do you have to work with that all the time? Ma'am, come on, let's go. Because it's raining out here and all of this could already be resolved. However, the situation began to get even more complicated when she began to feel like she was in a position to make demands. Exactly. Push the car seat over. What are you waiting for? I've already stated. Okay, he is unsafe. He's not unsafe. Are you okay? Did you see? You didn't see any of that? Because I'll take the, let's see, his badge number. It's he doesn't have a badge. Recorded. Neither of you yeah. have a badge, actually. Got it? Okay. Ma'am, let's, okay. let's go. Oh, now we got more? Yep. Okay. You can have the shoe and the pants if you want them. Go get it from that side, yep. Rich. Get the f off of me. Next is you're gonna get sprayed. Get the go right ahead. If that's your choice in life. Are you done? Are you done? Put your hands behind your back, Are please. Are you done? At this point, it had become clear that she was the type to make dumb decisions. But she was about to find out that these cops were not ready to joke around. Oh, you, you, you know. You know how wrong you two are right now. Oh, you You already hit me once, don't do it again. Actually, that's a good stretch. Ooh, you are a big boy. You are a big boy. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. 911! 911! 911! 911! Now, will you step out of the car? No, not until you take these off of me. That is not going to happen. I don't trust happen. either of you two. 911! 911! Take these off. Alright, come on out. As soon as they come off of me. They are not coming off. You're going into my car. I'm not going anywhere near you, but... All right. Touch my arm again. Oh, yeah! Oh, yes! Oh, yes! Yes! Come on! Are we done? I have it! <laughs> You're the one? I, oh, I'll let go of you? Oh, okay! I'll let me go of you! Oh, it's gonna be so good. You guys got a good lawyer. Huh? Yeah, I know, right? I'm I got it. Because you, so, so you didn't That's even. You didn't. That's right. You do? Yeah, but I'll move it just a second. I'll move it. Yeah. All right, have a seat, please. Oh, I see. You've got some friends here. Yep. I will happily. All the way in. Eventually, it started becoming obvious to her that she couldn't bully her way out of this situation as she had initially thought. It's a cute trick, though. All right, it's running. Thanks. So, did you want this? I mean, it's all part of your. So no, just check. Um, all part of what, so Ronaldo, saw what, what happened over there. I didn't. Yeah. I just listen. I saw. I saw you, and I saw something fall. I was like, whoa. Hey, I you didn't hear him yelling and banging on the window, huh? You didn't hear that part? All right, well, that was fun. All right, man. All right. Whenever you're ready. Whenever you're ready, honey.
Yeah. Miss, would you care to like give me your name? <laughs> Ma'am. I notice your tone has changed. That's good. But what about your heart rate? What is your first name, please? We could have started there. In the end, she was charged with petite theft, battery upon a police officer, and resisting arrest. Next, we go to the case of this woman who felt like she was above the law when she was arrested for causing an accident. Please do not touch me. I will report you. On the 7th of August, 2023, officers responded to the scene of an accident involving a drunk woman whose reckless driving resulted in that accident. When the officers approached the woman, although she appeared gentle at first, they did not know that they had just encountered a woman who hated being held accountable for her actions. Hey ma'am, how are you? I'm good, I'm gonna call my husband, I can't find my keys. Okay. No keys. Hey, my 20. Got an additional unit, 927. Yeah. Possible points, 19. It's okay. All right. I'm so, good. So, where, where are you coming from? Oh, nowhere. Just, I was bike riding. You were bike riding? Okay. Yeah. And where where were you bike riding at? I was bike riding on the Loveland Madeira Trail. Okay. And then how'd you get here? I drove. You drove here? Yeah. Okay. Did I'm you, good. Okay. Um, so I, I don't, I don't believe that you're good. You I realize, am. you realize that you've been involved in an accident? No. No, you don't, you don't realize you've been involved in an accident? No. What, what happened? I was still in an accident. You weren't in an accident? No. No? Okay. Well, I, I don't, I don't believe you, ma'am. You, you have got front end damage to the front of your vehicle. You said you drove here. From her response, it was immediately clear that she did not have any plans to cooperate with the officer. Instead of giving direct responses to the officer's questions, she pretended not to understand him at all. What's your name, ma'am? Um, I can't find my phone. What's your name, ma'am? Can I borrow your phone? Uh, I'm not gonna let you borrow my phone unless I know what who oh. you are. I think I just left my phone maybe with, at my friend's house. It's your friend's house? So yeah. did you go to your friend's house before or after the bike yeah, ride? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We ride every we ride every day. We Plan ride. B. You do? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we ride. We on the Napa okay. Auto Parts with Ohio. What's your name? Do you have your ID on, on you? Did I leave my phone we have with you, Kathy? Pathfinder with one freight. Did I leave my phone with you? I'm at Lowe's. I can't find my phone. Do you have my phone? Okay, I don't have my phone. I think okay. I left. What's your name, ma'am? What's your name? I don't need to tell you my name. Well, you are currently being detained. What? For a motor vehicle accident. For what? You struck another vehicle with your vehicle. Uh, no, I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Why do you say you didn't? I did not. Okay. Well, you just told me that you did. No, Because you I told did me not. that you drove, and then you've got witnesses that are stating that you hit another vehicle. Realizing that the cop wouldn't give up on finding out her true identity, she decided to give him her name, a name that later turned out to be fake. I did not. I deny it. I did not. So what is your name? I just want to be able to be polite and interact with you. I'm Officer Ryan. What's your name? Uh, Penelope. Penelope? What's your last name? I'm not going there. Okay. All right. Um, are you want, are you willing to do some uh, field tests for me to make sure that you're not intoxicated today? No, I'm no? not. I'm you're not intoxicated. No, I was riding bicycles. Okay. You see my pants? I understand that. So I don't understand why you're not being cooperative with me. I'm not. Okay. I just and then, needed a can of paint. I understand. <laughs> I see you got a can of paint, mm. and it seems like you're also struggling to get out of here. I. You don't can't. have your phone. You don't have your wallet. You don't have your your ID, your keys, anything. I do have my ID. Okay. All right. So, do you mind explaining to me what's going on? Why? No. Why you're not? You're not. I'm just cooperative? waiting for my husband because obviously I locked my keys in my car. For some reason, she did not care about the seriousness of the situation or the fact that she had just nearly cost other road users their lives. So you can be on your way. All right. Well, I'm not heading out anywhere. Okay. Are you? Are you? 
gonna state that you're not doing field tests for me? No, I am okay. not. So, at this point, if you're gonna refuse field tests, we're gonna escalate this. I'm gonna arrest you for OVI. What's that? Operating a vehicle impaired. No. Okay. So, from the evidence I've gotten from witnesses, I'm getting an odor of alcoholic beverage coming from you, and you're severely disoriented. You've locked your keys in the car. You're struggling to communicate with me effectively, and you're struggling to communicate over the phone with whoever you're on the phone with. I don't with. have my phone. I left it with my... Okay. Since it was now apparent that she was a woman who did not know that actions have consequences, the cops decided to show her that she was not above the law. So, are you, are you willing to do the field test? Show no. me that you're not impaired? Okay. I'm not willing to do anything, not sir. Not willing to do anything? No. Okay, can you turn around and put your hands behind your back? No. Nope. All right. No. You're going to turn around and put your hands okay. behind your back. All right. You're going to turn okay. around and put your hands All behind right. your back. All right, I'll do the thing. Nope. I'll do the nope. thing. Too late. We've already no. passed it. Turn around and put your hands behind your back. No, I'll do the thing. I'll Give do me your other hand. Thing. Give me your other hand. Do, Give me your other hand. Don't, don't touch me. I will report you. I will do the thing. I will do the thing, whatever you want me to do. Okay, my 20, F1, 26, right? No F-21, I will not do, I will do the thing. I'm buying paint. Don't, don't do this. You're, you're already past that, man. I, don't Put your hands this. together, like you're praying. Don't do this. I will walk the mask. walk, whatever you want. Nope, too late. No. We're not doing this. No, we are not doing this. No, I re uh, no, 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 no. We're not doing this. You are not. Do not touch me. Please do not touch me. I will report you. Ow, that hurts. Ow. Put your hands behind your back now. Sir. Guys, come on. Mary 12, we're one I detained. I am not hurting anyone. Hey, You're under arrest for resisting. Resisting what? Resisting arrest. Yeah, you just stacking charges. I don't know. I didn't do anything, ma'am. If you didn't do anything, you should listen to what they said. I know. I know. Although she was already in trouble, she continued to be a brat, at least until the cop reminded her that he was no longer tolerating her crazy behavior. All right, let's go. Wait, 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 wait. No, stop. I, I will drag you to this car in front of I everybody. Know. I Excuse don't care, let's go. Me. I have a question. Well, wait, you wait. lost that privilege. I have questions. I wanna know. You're under arrest for OBI, resisting arrest and obstruction. Can I just please call my husband? Nope. No? You're going to go to jail. Oh, good. All right. Do you have your cameras on? Yep. Good. I need my phone. Well, you'll be lucky to get that. Why do you have to be so mean? Why do you have to not listen to us? So go Look, ahead and take a seat in the car. I am a really nice woman. Well, Why you're not you showing that right now. Go ahead and sit in the car. Why do you have to be so mean? Well, it All right. is. I was on. Six o'clock. You're intoxicated. No, Go ahead and sit not. in the car. Sit I in the was car. on a bike ride with my friend. Sit in the car. And I stopped to get cash. Sit in the car or I'm going to put you in there. Don't be so mean. Sit in the car or I'm going to put you in there. You do not have to be so mean. Sit in the car. I will. Why are you being so aggressive? In the car. Jesus God! In the car. This is your in the car. I'm gonna pull you in. Oh my God! Eventually, she began to realize that crazy people get what they deserve. Oh my God, Kathy! Jesus Christ! Ah! Hello. Little boy, can I get my phone out of my car, please, to call my husband? Hello? Do you need anything else from me? Yes, I need my phone. Yeah, sounds very good. Yeah. Right. No, I need my phone. Oh, hello. Uh, you accosted me, and I'm sorry I don't remember what the f 
is your name and it's raining and I'm trying to get home and what is your name ah! oh my god you're jerking me around back here I'm reporting you I am so reporting you ah! and now I'm handcuffed I'm reporting you what is your name sir Ryan, Officer Ryan. I've got lots of stuff on you, Ryan. At this point, she began to give the cop even more reasons why crazy Karens should be taught some life lessons. Ryan, you little shit. Give me my purse. That is mine. Where are we going? Where are we going? Answer me, Ryan. Where are we going? You better tell me where the jail is or I'm going to report what you said. Claremont County Jail. Could you please tell me where that is? Oh my God. I can't even see. You better turn on your windshield wipers, buddy. I'm going to report you. I can't even see out of the window. Turn them on faster. My grandma, I've never been arrested. I've never had anything. Why are you doing this? Claremont County Jail. Oh, perfect. Oh, perfect. Out in the boonies with the boonie, boonie, people. Jesus God, you all make me sick. And the man that was in my face yelling at me, what the f was his name? Sergeant what? Huh? Uh, you have to talk louder. I'm hard of hearing. I left my hearing. Get me out. My shoulders are killing me. Swing your feet first. My shoulders are killing me. I'm staying there. I'm a bike rider. I'm, I know. You oh, seem like you're in good it. shape then. What? You said if you're a bike rider, you're in good shape then, right? Okay. We're going this way. Was that derogatory? No, it wasn't. I said you Yes, it shape. was. You're in oh, good my shape. God. Oh, man. Oh, my God. Let's go. You Let's are go. going down. I feel. Oh, you're in good shape then. Yes, you talked about how you ride bicycles, that's, that's good. In the end, she was charged with resisting arrest and given a court date for operating a vehicle while impaired.